in this presentation, you will learn the theorem concerning triangles on the same base and between the same parallel line and triangles between parallel lines with equal heights, right? Let's start with triangles on the same base and between the same parallel line, right? The theorem states, if triangles have the same best and are between the same parallel lines, then they have the same area, right? This is the model of that theorem. You can see that the base is AB and the height is H. So triangle A, B, D, the one in red, and triangle A, B, C, they have the same area, right? So in simple, we simply write if CD is parallel to AB and triangle ABC and triangle ABD have a common base that is AB, then we can conclude that their areas are the same because the height cannot change for any of the two triangles because the height is the distance between the two parallel lines. So it then is the same thing, right? So as such, to prove this, it is a trivial effort. Why? Because uh, to find the area of each triangle, we use the formula half base times height. But here the base is the same, the height is the same. So there's no way we can hope to get something different. Okay, the second situation, triangles between parallel lines with the equal altitude, that is with the same height, right? It is said that if triangles on parallel lines have equal altitude, then the ratio of their areas is equal to the ratio of the lengths of their bases. Here is the model of that theorem. Right, this is the base of the first triangle ABC. QR is the base of the second triangle PQR, but they have the same height H because they are between the same parallel. So the distance between parallel lines will never change. And we are saying if this is the case, then we are saying uh, the ratio of their area is equal to the ratio of the length of their basis, right? This we are going to prove the theorem. So let's look at the uh, symbols to that theorem. We are simply saying AP parallel to BC. AP, remember, is on X as a line. Then BC is on Y as a line. So by putting AP is parallel to BC, is the same as saying, X as the line is parallel to Y as the line, right? Triangle ABC and triangle PQR have the same altitude, height, which is the H, right? Then we can conclude that the area of triangle ABC over area of triangle PQR is equals to the best BC over the best QR. That is what the theorem simply states. Now, we wanted to prove this theorem and we know that this is the given information and what you want to arrive at is this relationship. So obviously the fact that we are talking of areas, then I should start by finding the areas of each triangle, then find the ratio of their areas and I expect to arrive at this conclusion. So the area of triangle ABC, right is half bc which is the best times the height h then i'm simply writing it neatly in this format but it's one and the same thing right i do the same to triangle uh pqr this area is half the base is qr the height is h then i write it neatly as this right now i have the areas of the respective triangles what i want is to find uh, the ratio of the areas. Therefore, area triangle ABC over area of triangle PQR, right? I then substitute for the respective. This is for 
area of triangle ABC, which is this one. But the line represents division. So I'm going to substitute it by a division sign so that I write my work neatly. So the area of triangle PQR, which is this one, is the one I have here. Then from there, I change the division sign to a multiplication sign. Then I substitute this divisor by its reciprocal or inverse, which is this one, right? Then you realize that the two and the two will cancel, the H and the H will cancel. I remain with BC over QR. And we have shown that the area ratio is equal to the ratio of their respective basis. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.